Welcome to UC. I'm Dona, and I'm studying physics and geology. I'm Izzy, and I'm studying geology and geography. We're here to show you around and give you a few tips on life at UC. This is the Ernest Rutherford Building. It's the heart of science here at UC. It was built in 2018, so it has the latest facilities for studying science. On the ground floor, you'll find the cafe, ancestral, and the geography lab. On the second floor are learning spaces for geology and geography students. On the third floor, there are physics and biology labs. On the fourth floor is chemistry and biology. Finally, the level five has postgrad, research, and staff spaces. Throughout the building, there are great study spaces. Next to Ernest Rutherford is the Beatrice Tinsley Building, where you'll find your lecturers from the School of Earth and Environment and the School of Physical and Chemical Sciences. Adjoining Beatrice Tinsley is the Putaya Koyora Building, where you'll find the School of Biological Sciences. The School of Psychology, Speech and Hearing is located behind the Arts Car Park and is next to the Rahua Building. On the ground floor is Cafe 101, Speech and Hearing Clinics and the Psychology Center. The school's reception is on level one. The School of Computer Science and Software Engineering and the School of Mathematics and Statistics are based in the Erskine Building. It's located by the Science Road car park. It's got heaps of computer labs and Reboot Cafe does great coffee. The Engineering Corps is located on Creek Road next to the Ernest Rutherford Building. Some of you guys might have classes here and you'd probably want to check out Nuts and Volts Cafe. Some of you might have classes in Rahua too. It's got heaps of study spaces, and therapy is another great cafe. There are teaching spaces all across campus, including the buildings we were just in. But the three main lecture blocks are C Block, North Arts, and South Arts. Try to get to your classes on time, but if you're arriving late, go through the back. This is Puaka James Height, AKA the Central Library. This is a great place to study. This is also where you'll find Te Pataka, a one-stop shop for help of all kinds, including first-year student advice, help with your enrollment or timetable, ID cards, finance and study link, IT, and learn your learning portal. There are all sorts of support services at UC, including the Academic Skills Centre, Student Care, Career Service, the Equity and Disability Service, and Te Waka Pa Ka Kano, the Office of Maori, Pacific and Equity. Underneath Pokai James Height is the Undercroft, where you'll find cafes and eateries and a communal space. There's also a physio, a pharmacy, New Zealand Post, and banking facilities. The other library you might need to visit is the EPS Library down on Creek Road. This provides services and collections to support engineering, forestry, sciences, and Antarctica studies. You can get your textbooks and stationery from the University Bookshop on University Drive. This is the UC Rec Centre. Membership's free. Here we've got heaps of great facilities, such as a gymnasium, weights room, boxing room, squash courts, climbing room, and much more. This is Hararoa, the new hub of UC students in the home of UCSA. It includes student welfare and advocacy spaces, an outdoor amphitheatre, as well as club, meeting, hospitality, office, and event spaces. Just across the car park is the UC Health Center, where you can get subsidized GP visits, free counseling, and vaccinations. And that's it for your tour. Now go and explore. There's so much to get involved in here at UC. The club scene is incredible, and there's so many events throughout the year that you can get involved in. So get out there, get amongst it, and have a good time. <laughs>